Hey everybody, it's Book of Catherine. So as someone with functional neurological disorder, uh, mine happens to be the worst in pain. But one of the things that happened to me was that I couldn't wear boots like this all the time. And my feet were curled up like this for years and years and years and I lost my muscle. So what I've been slowly doing, um, 2017 was just getting, <laughs> 2017 took a while, but um, in through 2019, we started getting my feet down here, but it took a while. At the end of fall of 2019, um, I could just get my feet to be like this. Um, and that took a lot of work, but I had some amazing, amazing doctors, as you guys know, before I was diagnosed. But when I was diagnosed, they I started moving even faster. So one of the things that I can do now, every single day without an episode, I can do this. I can open up my toes, which is new. And also, I can rotate my ankles. <laughs> That's taken like three years to do. A lot of work. I had to stop filming. They told me to stop. I had to do a lot of changes once I was diagnosed. But for those of you with functional neurological disorder, FND, if you weren't diagnosed like me for like a long, long time, you know how big this is. So anything like this is like super huge. And I just wanted to see how I'm able to speak at the same time as doing it. So if you go back in 2019, you'll see I was trying to just point my foot like that and it made me scream in pain. And both my feet were like, and just trying to point like that, oh, the agony I would scream in. And so I just wanted to show you guys, their goal for me was to move every day and I am moving every day. Um, and like when I did the video, the challenge, the revolution challenge, like I didn't have an episode after that. I was able to go back to bed and just get myself nudged in with all my positioning. So I just wanted to show you like what all your support has meant to me and my family and to my progress. I just wanted to show you that I can actually move my ankles at least once a day now without any episode while talking and I can move my toes like I'll have to rest for about an hour after doing this with you but my point is is like the f ability to do this like even walking has really really improved um and I sit like cross-legged all the time I sit like that at least half of my day now which is huge you guys to sit the cross-legged like I was on my side or on my back for the almost the entire day and then I'd film and go lay back down for a few days and now every day I sit up cross-legged and now I can, the, even the fact that I'm straightening my legs is like a massive, massive deal. So I just wanted to show you all the movement that I've gotten. Oh, I'm kind of overdoing it now. So, but it's so exciting and the cats aren't used to it. I have a video that I'm going to be sharing with you that you wouldn't understand if you haven't seen this video, but like my cats didn't see my toes move or my feet move for the longest time. They're having to get used to mommy moving now. And so Tasmanian freaks out every time he sees my toes. He like, they've never moved. He didn't even know I had, he, they're like a strange thing to him, right? And so he tries to hunt them. Like when, when I'm up and I'm walking or whatever, and if my toes move, he starts hunting them. It's so cute. So I try to take a video of that for you and I'll try and share that this week. Anyway, thank you guys so much for your support. It's making a big difference. Here, I'll actually show you like, watch, I can do this. I can get up on my own see that while talking and there my feet are and see how they're turned out you guys it's like a miracle and watch this I'll even get my own shoes on like do you know how long it's been since I've been able to get my own shoes on oh my gosh you guys it's been so long so getting a diagnosis really helps but most of all your support because it has been a massively expensive expensive we had no idea how expensive the medical we had no idea how much this treatment would cost so you know I was close to dying, as our doctor said, and you guys just like brought me back from the dead and gave me a reason. Look at that. Okay, I'm right now. I'm just gonna take. See, I just fell over. <laughs> I just fell over on the wall. All right, I better go. I'm wearing out. You can hear me. But isn't that great? Anyway, thank you guys so much. I love you. Bye.